Hello everyone, it is I, Sakamoto, and we're going to play Jazz Funk Director's Cut. Uh, this is a really, really funny game you can get on Steam. I don't know how much it costs because I bought it like six years ago or something. I think I bought it for like 20 bucks. Might be cheaper now. Steam's always got sales though, so if you put it on your wish list, you'll usually get an email saying, Hey, this game's on sale, whenever it is, so you can probably, it'll probably goes on sale for like at least five at most five bucks uh, when it is on sale so anyways um, I've played this game a little bit I never actually beat it so we're gonna do that starting today um, and I think that's about it um, but this game's really funny you can interact with all the stuff which we're also gonna do a little bit of and yeah let's just get into it Also, all of the um, people in this game, you'll see, they look very uh, familiar, that's for sure. Necrophone Games Presents. I mean, you'll right here, right off the bat, you see them. They look like freaking bathroom person signs. I don't know what those are called, but yeah. <laughs> Right off the bat, that's already pretty funny. <laughs> Ooh, the music. Yeah. What am I doing? I'm messing with a paper towel. You probably heard that. <laughs> like I had two of them in my hand. I was <laughs> ripping them like, hey. I'll do it again, too. Can you hear this? Oh, you probably heard that. <laughs> I just washed my hands, I had to get them super dry, so I got paper towels next to me. <sighs> it's not the other thing, if that's what you were thinking. <laughs> Alright, game starting. Woohoo, game time. Alright, so there's a suitcase we shipped ourselves in um, via the uh, airplane luggage and if you go up to this box and interact with it I'm just a box leave me alone okay you got it buddy bye so we're using the mouse pad to look around like a normal um, first-person game on the PC and uh, yeah okay if you try I'm pressing E why is it not working aha there we go for use the articles does Ruchukan scanning cause schizophrenia? Oh, I was already, but I wanted to look at the articles. We got black hat inside. Leaked spec on the 4902 lockout ship. Okay. Reader's digestive organs. Ooh, black market price guide. <laughs> okay. Soak the wet wear enthusiast magazine and playbot entertainment. Low gauges. Estable and bustable. High voltage. Alrighty then. I'm sure there are people who are into that. Alright, Miss Bathroom Sign Lady. Hello, bath I will say we must business to this Bathroom site. 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 Sign. Guy. Alright. Hey, right, look at that. I wonder what's going to happen when we sit down. Um, I'm trying to... Do I have to look at it? Why is this not working? Basically, we need you to infiltrate the Soviet complex. Okay. That's what. So you've taken some of our important technology, and it's imperative that we get it back on the right hand. Oh, that thing. On the right. The usual, here's your mission or what? Don't take too many. I have to take a pill to do the mission. If you need me, I'll be in the wine cellar. Um, does that mean I'm just gonna be hallucinating the whole thing? Am I already hallucinating? Why is the wine cellar under your desk and you fell asleep? 
You even have a little martini going on there, and you're not even drinking it. Whatever. Whatever, man. This is... Okay. Alright. Infiltrate the Soviet consulate. PLO. Um, obtain the data cartridge. Japanese that I can't read. Alright. Uh, okay. Take one capsule. Every mission, or until reality is sufficiently augmented. You got it. Starting mission in five, four, three, two, one. Yeah, loading. Loading screen, we're on the loading. Not anymore. Oh wow, that was fast. Okay. Infiltrate the Soviet consulate. You got it. So let's go do a little bit of interacting. Let's talk to this guy. He's got a pull string. Believe in yourself. Oh, okay. Best Friends forever. Uh, okay, goodbye. <laughs> Do you have the gun? No. Can I come back later with it, though? Because, like, I tried asking him... I went up to him and I said, and he said that, and I'm just like, okay. That's nice. Yeah, apparently, like, there will be a person on each one of these bridges, and if you just run up to them, they do that, so. And then they're in the middle of the street, but the cars just run through them, so they're fine. <laughs> Alright, other bathroom sign people, what's going on? Whoa, is that something we can interact with? No, okay, but it says, CM cracks in it. Alright, hello. I don't have a dollar. Turing. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh, boy. All right. I know what Turing is, I just I got a Go like this. was confused about why she said that for a second. Alright, Mr. Jazz Guy. I got some upcoming gigs. Almost a terabyte. I love that. I record on that. Alright. I wonder if we can get the MacGuffin in this area. Whatever that means. Take this decouser. Use it to scramble three carrier frequency pigeons. Hit each pigeon three times in order to degauss it. Uh, okay. Terrier pigeons. Got it. Man, my stomach is... Congratulations, you're the 1,032nd player to inspect this garbage. I didn't actually inspect it, but okay. Hello. Yeah, these guys don't actually talk. And I did not mean to do anything to him. Oh, okay. This messes with people. Got it. <laughs> oh, these guys are funny. They're like everywhere. Sure you stole my oh, okay. <laughs> oh yeah, you've got to cycle the inventory, make it go away, to make them do something normal. He's gone. That's great. Where are the carrier pigeons? Carrier I know I saw a bunch of them earlier. Alright. No, there's gonna be another guy up on this bridge too. Um Hey, come back here. Aha. Uh -huh. Wait, how many times oh my goodness. Get back here! Oh my gosh. I'm just wondering if this will get us the MacGuffin, because I don't know what happens when you actually do that correctly. And get the MacGuffin. I'm curious. I want to know. What's the MacGuffin all about? What is the MacGuffin? 
Where did the pigeon go? Hey, pigeon, where did you go? This is completely normal, what I'm doing to you. Come back. <laughs> uh... Oh, there he is. Aha, uh -huh, got him. Um... Alright, let's go get two more. I hope there wasn't exactly three. Oh, this is pretty funny. Can I interest you in a stick of gum? My eyes. Yeah, oh man, I didn't get the sh shot with the freaking face cam, basically. He uh, hit that and then he just, yeah, as you can see. Because I blew the gum in his face, and... Well, totally ruined that freaking joke. Whatever. Xerox Park, that's funny. Alright. Did I just create a Xerox somewhere? Where did it... Whatever. Okay. Are you okay, my guy? I hope you're okay. Pigeons, pigeons, who's got the pigeons? Maybe there's another one on this other bridge. Or near it. Or whatever, you know what I mean. Flying around on it? Yeah. I played this a little bit, um, trying to make... Um... Tried recording some of this earlier, and I got to the second mission. And looking back at the tape, there was this, like, little side quest where you, this wrestler comes out of a wall. And then you go to this, like, alternate reality where you fight him. Unfortunately, uh, the way it came out on video, it was, like, really bad. So, like, it, there, you couldn't see what I was doing or what was going on, basically. You just would see flashes. So I had to scratch it and start the whole game over, basically. That's as far as I got, though. Let's find out. <laughs> Wait. Oh, he's eating chicken. Okay. Hello, Mr. Pigeon. You'll be okay. Don't worry about it. You're gonna be fine. I'm just gonna grab this perfume bottle and trade it for hopefully the MacGuffin. Okay. Yeah, I know. What? Oh. There we go, okay. Last carrier pigeon, where are you? I will find you. Aha, I found you! <laughs> How convenient. Oh no. Come back. Don't you know I need your perfume juice? Apparently. Get back here! Where did you go? Oh, aha, there you are. Oh, ho, oh, oh, ho, how do I get over there? Yeah, I'd love to. How do I get that? Oh, there we go. Okay, good. Okay, what the? I thought I saw something. No? Nothing interesting over here? Okay, back to the other guy. Back to the other guy, back, back to the other guy, we're gonna go back to the other guy, there was another pigeon there, which means we didn't have to only find only three in the area. Heck yeah. Alright, after we do this, we'll go do the mission. Bibbidi doo bidi da bidi why am I, why, why? Was that bird crap? Oh my goodness, it was bird crap. Hilarious. I've actually been crapped on by a bird a couple times. I mean, I'll just be riding my bike and then be, <laughs> be under the side on the sidewalk and there would be a bird up on the frickin', you know, the landlines or whatever. Next thing I know, I've just got bird crap on my head. Sometimes they do it from trees too. I think it happened like one or two other times. Anyways. 
Thanks for collecting the pigeons. Oh. This is my Mima's secret pigeon pot pie recipe. Uh oh. Please wait while they bake. Um. Just like Mima used to make. <laughs> I have fourth degree burns all over my entire face. I'm sorry. Ah, uh, it burns. Ah. Uh, well, you don't sound like you're very. Right. I have fourth degree burns all over my entire face. You don't sound like you're all that much in pain. So you're fine, right? Hello, robot lady. So I don't have the MacGuffin, but I have lots of perfume. Now I still want the MacGuffin, though. I know I said that we were going to do the mission, but where's the MacGuffin? What is it? Can I pick that up? Extra strength plus Cbex. Never take placebex after taking mission all. Oh god, is everything gonna be all fricked up now? I had a feeling that would affect us. Hello, other robot. Hi, Brello. My name is Johnny. Too. Hello. I got an idea. Press this button. Is that was that a joke? Are you okay? Oh he is okay. Uh, I'm too barrier to a trash can all right. in almost every way. Hey. You're late. Okay. Find the mailbox marked with chalk on the side. Okay. Oh, there's so many frickin' mailboxes. Alright. Go away. Who just said that to me? Is that you? Yeah? Okay, bye. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, well that works. Oh. Okay, I just pressed E a lot up on him. And, uh, that's what happened. Is this the one? Maybe. Okay, he needs my help. He's trying to get free Wi-Fi from Starbucks. He dropped his password cracker on the road. Oh no. We're playing Frogger. <gasps> Yeah, are you okay? I'm sorry, buddy. God dang it. He looks worst. 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 I read almost. And it made me say worst. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh no! Damn it! Damn it! <laughs> Please, no more! Does it again. I have to do this for you! Oh, what if they made this actually impossible? It can't be impossible. There we go. Go ahead, put it on. Amphibian data sensor. Vis visor. Collect eight data packets to crack the network. Um. Oh. Okay. I gotta be honest, guys. I did not do the frog thing. I didn't even notice it. Or the uh, last thing we did. Or try to find the MacGuffin. I have no saliva. This is all new to me. I didn't, I've never even done this in my... The first time I played this. Did I get it? No. The number's on the bottom right. Derp. Come on. Come on, 127001. 127.0.0.1. Thanks, now a little privacy, please. Is that, is that it? That, that didn't do anything. But hey, I think I've... Ooh, I did find it. 
Hello. There's a man in the park sitting on a bench. <gasps> Deliver this package to him. This must be the MacGuffin. Yay, I found it. I have the MacGuffin. Haha. Here with the MacGuffin. I'm here with the MacGuffin. Yeah, I have no idea. If you like go look for that dude, he just completely vanishes like he never existed. And he appears behind random trees throughout the park. Have a seat, but keep your eyes forward. Have a seat. Locate the newspaper box marked with a piece of chewing gum. Okay. Great. Another look for dumb stuff quest. Okay. <sighs> Hey, how are we doing, pigeon? Guy who had gum in his face? Other guy? Still in the same places, huh? Is the other guy still out there? He's completely gone. I hope he's alright. I was one. They treat me like garbage. Yeah, I was wondering if that box was gonna be interactive. What do you say? It would have gum? Yeah. Okay. Those are the newspaper boxes. Got it. Alright. Hmm. Nope, not that one. You bitty you buddy, gobbity blah buddy, shoo buddy whoop daddy. Here we go. Open news box. You're almost there, Agent. Go to the Raytheon Motel. Knock on the door using the secret knock. <laughs> knock correctly, and you'll be right inside. The what motel? Whatever. Can you tell me the name of that motel again? Hey, a basketball. Um, okay then. That was entertaining. Let me see here. This must be where the motel- I'm just kidding. Excuse me. I gotta go talk to that newspaper box again. If it'll talk to me. You're almost there, Agent. Go to the Lavion Motel. Lavion. Knock on the door using the secret knock. That must be it. Knock directly, and you'll be right inside. Yeah, that's probably it. Aha! Congratulations, you've made it. Oh, we got another pigeon person here. Why is this with these guys and pigeons? What do we do now? This carrier frequency pigeon possesses top secret information. Oh. We need you to smuggle it into the next level. Okay. Any means necessary. All right. Don't let us down. You got it. This trench coat's made of the finest bald eagle pelt. All right. The cat is in the toilet. Okay. I repeat. The cat is in the toilet. The cat is in the toilet. This trench coat's made of the finest bald eagle pelts. Well done. We'll be keeping an eye on you. Yay! Now we can do the mission. I'm, I'm just gonna go do the mission now, for real, this time. Uh, how do I get out of here? Assuming I can figure out how to leave. Aha, uh -huh, that must be the door. Yep. Nice hat, buddy. Hope you're alright down there. Probably just taking a nice nap. Right, he swallowed the pigeon. The mission's actually really short and easy, so... I already know what to do. I'm afraid you don't have a point here. I mean, you can just talk to her. You have 
and him, but what you really need to do is go up to here and see how it says lunchtime, communist plotting, vodka and biscuits, potato sack race. You need to make it 12 o'clock. Ah, oh, crap. Hold on. I know what to... Ah! There we go. Aha! Uh -huh, I figured it out. There we go. And these guys go away and you can jump on the scaffolding. And yeah, another funny thing. Your main character doesn't actually have hands or arms. He just somehow carries these weird hand cardboard appendage things. Which is weird because he doesn't have hands to carry them with. Anyway. Yeah, you just go up there and press E. That's basically hitting that button. Um... I'm trying to read the sign, but I already know what it says. We saw it from afar. This is... Yeah, it's just a little spiral thing. You can mess with these uh, microscopes. Play a little game of Space Invaders. Apparently the lasers don't really affect you, so whatever. Never mind, they do. I want to try that again. You know what I don't get about space invaders? These things that um, protect you, kind of. Oh my gosh. But they also protect your enemies. Ah, we did it. It only gives you one level. Oh, this is kind of funny if you look at this other one. <laughs> okay. Alright, and I don't need the perfume. Or do I? Alright, um... So now... Oh, this is kind of funny. There's a photocopier here, and we are copy photocopying our butt. And you can see down there, the pictures of our butt. Haha, <laughs> you can use it to have a disguise of yourself, which we do need, but not that. Unless it does work. No, show the disguise. Oh my god. There we go. Okay, it worked. That's hilarious. Because there's another picture in here that you're, I thought you're supposed to use, but apparently that one works fine. Where is it? Is that it? Yeah. Alright. That's the one I used before when I did this earlier. Okay. All I need is a human hat. Oh, that's hilarious. No, thank you. Uneventful news day seizes a nation. Moon explodes, page 63. Isn't that freaking hilarious? Alright, we need to go up to this computer. It gives us a little simulation here. Go up to this uh, phone and it says, a tone of 26... What she said. <laughs> right. So, the comrade needs to, you know, blah, 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 who cares. For, um, point here is that we get the, we can get the whistle, just uh, 2600 hertz, by emptying out the cereal, pressing E a bunch of times, grabbing the whistle, going up to this thing. Um, and all we got it, okay. That's all you gotta do. <laughs> and the mission's complete. That was it. 
Basically, we gotta get out of here, though. As soon as I find... Oh, there it is. So, that's it. We're done. Basically. Okay, that's funny. <sighs> Ice alarm. Makes a bunch of fire appear. That's really funny. I mean, then you'd have to pull the fire alarm. So I think we just need to go down this garbage chute and we're basically finished here. Going down a garbage chute, going down a garbage chute. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh yeah, and then we're sitting here. Uh, we got this. Okay. Smuggle a carrier pigeon into the next level. We're basically just feeding these koi. This is a really beautiful, nice place, obviously. Here you go, guys. Enjoy. And then that's it. Welcome back. Our benefactors wish to extend their gratitude. I hope you're ready for another job. Yeah. This is a biotech engineer working for Raytheon Corp. Okay. These star connections seem to have afforded him a particularly valuable artificial key. Nice. Estimated value on the red market is over 25 billion yen. We need you to extract this from them at any cost. Okay. I know you do well by me. All right, guys, I'm going to end this video. If you don't mind, I've got a landline to install. Um, and I will see you all in the next one. But we'll check this out real quick. Really funny. He just, now he's not even sleeping comfortably. He's just <laughs> in a really bad position right now for uh, any kind of enjoyment, in my opinion. But we're going to go and do this next. It's a pretty good mission, pretty funny. That's the one where... I'll, I'll show you the wrestler guy coming out of the wall. If we don't approach him, he won't make us fight him. But, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys then. Love you guys. Have a great...